not forget this. Thanks. Your father did the heavy lifting. You should stay, recover. You have done enough. You know my door is always open to you. Sorry, guess we're going. Now then, before Modi so rudely interrupted us, we were just about to explore Tyr's vault. Yes, to find the Black Rune. Boy, do you know the way from here? Oh, I don't know. Sure you do, lad. We need a boat. I don't know. I guess we need a boat. Okay then. See? The boat washed ashore. Someone did call a serpent earlier. Get in. I will pull. You are quiet. Are you not better? I guess. I know you overheard my talk with Freya. You think you understand, but you do not. Why do you say nothing? You said I was cursed. You think I'm weak because I'm not like you. I know I was never what you wanted. But after all this, I thought... Maybe things were different. You do not know everything, boy. No. But at least I know the truth now. The truth. The truth. I am a god, boy. From another land far from here. When I came to these shores, I chose to live as a man. But the truth is, I was born a god, and so were you. Boy, have you nothing to say? Um, can I turn into an animal? Can you turn into an animal? No. No, I do not think so. I'm a god. Mother knew? She was a god too? No. She was mortal, but she knew my true nature. I'm a god. Why did you wait so long to tell me? Time of anguish and tragedy. That is the curse. Hmm. What sorts of things can I do? Can I fly? Or turn invisible? I don't feel like God. I do not know the reach of your godhood. But over time, you will learn. You sure I can't turn into a wolf? You are welcome to surprise me. Is this why I hear voices sometimes? 
Are you sure you've never heard any? Not as you do. That's no surprise. Every god is unique. So, maybe I won't get strong like Father, but I'll have abilities all my own? You already do, laddie. Your faculty for language is extraordinary for one so young. Time alone will tell what else you'll become capable of. So you knew all along? I did, lad. But I've known more than my share of gods. Me too, apparently. I wonder who else knew I was a god. Freya, for sure. Rock and Sindri? They do not need to know. Balder! Does he know? Is that why he's after us? Do you know him from before? The day of your mother's funeral was the first I ever saw Balder. That is the truth. Hey, we don't have to go right back to Tears Vault, do we? I mean, we're God. We can do whatever we want, right? What do you really feel like doing right now? I will show you. Come here. What can you tell me about that giant lady with the bow? She was called Skadi, Queen of the Hunt. Her father was Thiotzi, who could take the shape of any wild creature and taught Skadi how to hunt them all. From the ribs of pack beasts, she fashioned second feet, allowing her to glide upon the snow so no animal could evade her. She became a huntress beyond compare, even to any god. Odin himself wanted her for his bride, believing she would bear him strong sons. You know what? Let's try this again, without interruptions. Here we go again. Read it. Death itself I swallow, to spring forth life tomorrow. Oh, I like that one. I wonder if I wrote it. Is that the answer there? says Earth. Hmm, swallows death, brings forth life. Yeah. I wish I had known I was a god in Elfheim. I wouldn't have felt so bad about killing so many elves. Well, I'm not sure that's the lesson. You've done nothing to regret. The elves forced their affairs upon us. No, I get it now. We had god things to do, and they were in the way, dragging us into their little problems. Again, are we just leaving that there? I mean, just knowing we're gods makes me feel so much stronger. Maybe you feel a little too good right now. With power comes a big choice, lad. You can either serve yourself, or put your godhood in the service of others, like Tyr did. People really loved him, huh? Aye, a god of war, but one who fought for peace. Had a reputation for being heroic and lawful, using his power and knowledge to stop wars rather than start them. So there are good gods. Once in a moon it's been known to happen, yes.
This one mentions places I've never heard of. Seems Tyr really liked to travel. Tyr believed the mind, not might, was key to preventing war and chaos. And he also knew visiting other cultures would give him perspective staying in one place could not. While Odin always hoarded knowledge, guarding it jealously, Tyr was open and sharing with his learning and his wisdom. For this, mortals adored Tyr, showing their love by bringing him gifts the world over. So, whatever happened to Tyr? Odin came to regard him as a threat to his rule. He suspected Tyr of collaborating to aid the giants instead of helping to steal their secrets for the Aesir. The same thing he accused me of, frankly. Though in Tyr's case, I believe he was right. You think Tyr was helping the giants? I do. He felt responsible for the suffering visited upon them by Odin. I suspect he had something to do with helping them cover their tracks. The missing Jotunheim town. Correct. Whatever happened to it, I believe it could only have been done with Tyr and the Giants working together. Where is this black? Don't know. I've never been in here. No. It's kind of hoping, though. So what now? Brother, a trap for the winds of hell. But where do you think the winds are? The winds of what? Oh, we forgot to mention that. When you were sick, we went to Helheim to get your cure. You did? Terrible experience, by the by. Your dad picked up a new trick, though, with a little help from Brock. Brock was there, too? I... but... We'll get back to this later. That's unfriendly. Look, small passages on either side. Perfect for the boy. Careful, brother. Rhea's not here to bring you back if you're cutting too.
What'd you find? Enough distraction. Do not forget why we are here. Okay. That's from a great desert land, very far from here. Bad buzzer? Oh my, yes. Many, many gods. Good or bad? And not as simple as that, I'm afraid. Seen that vault that set you off. It is not important. Seem important to you. You need not dwell on my failings. Wow. That was almost an apology. Well, I guess you do like that. <laughs> If it hurts me or not, I want to learn. Just because you hate being a god doesn't mean I have to. More small passages. I know. Go. I can't watch, brother.
Then I thought those saws were scary. Look, it's the wolf giants, Skull and Hati. That's right, the bringers of day and night. Ragnarok begins when they catch the sun and moon, right? Did Tyr know them? I don't know. Liked them well enough to cover a massive wall in his vault with them, though. Don't you enjoy it at all? Being a god? On an adventure in some amazing place? Maybe Mother wanted us to have a little fun. Everything we've seen and done. Maybe it was her gift. is faster than wind. Hmm. Perhaps this isn't about speed at all. Is there someplace else the winds can go? Look! There's the wind trap! Atreus, to me! Okay, I'm coming! Chases the sun. For Ragnarok to happen, they have to eat them. These are out of order. Good boy. So the moon goes on the left, sun on the right. With Midgard in the middle, but which bar do I pull? Pull the right! The right boy! The middle! Middle, quickly! 
something. saved you. That was cunning, boy. See what tears got for us. Oh, no, Ray's protection room. It rubbed off. What should we do? We keep going. There it is. We've got it. Certain. I got it. Trust me. Good then. Aim for the face.
match for us gods. I have beaten bigger. <laughs> Puny troll. Yeah. I'm turned around. Which way is the sandball back up? close to the end. End. Really? It smells like rotten eggs. Is it still good? Possibly. Father, why did you leave your home and come here? Does it have to do with the other gods there? Hmm. It's just, you hate the gods so much. But Tyr proves that gods can be good. And you're good. You only killed those deserving, right? Yes. Ah. But who's worthy enough to judge? Quiet, Head. We are. We know better. Uh huh. Sounding more like your da by the moment. Ready. Ready. Come. I think I'm gonna like being a god. And now we're gonna go see the giants. Aye. Having learned that travel rune to Jotunheim, we can now head back to the gateway on top of the peak and put that magic chisel to good use. Nobody's getting in our way this time. Come on. I can read what this says now, but it's a name. Rota! Whoa! The name made it light up! It's the name of one of the Valkyries. That's quite curious. I'm gonna tell Sindri I'm a god. I'd like to see the look on his face. No, I may have kept your secret too long, but now you will keep our secret. Huh. 